South Florida Science Center Aquarium, that's where we are right now, is a completely new place. We've doubled our attendance, we have doubled our revenues, we've doubled our physical space, and we have doubled all of our educational programming throughout the region. We're very pleased with the results and the reactions that people have had to this place. This is a new science center, a totally new science center in terms of the direction we've moved. We've gone from being a place where you kind of come and look at science to a high touch place where you can come and do science. I am so thrilled to tell you about some of the new exciting programs we have here at the Science Center. We knew we had to stay relevant, stay with the times, so what did we do? We made a robotics program. We now have our own FLL robotics team here at the Science Center. We have, it's happening right behind me, our GEMS Club, girls excelling in math and science. A new club that introduces young girls to career paths they might never have thought of before. Our mission here at the Foundation is to support science and enhance science education in Palm Beach County. We want to ensure that children have an opportunity to learn and to have hands-on experience with science education. We want to make sure that our children here in Palm Beach County are prepared and equipped for those cutting-edge science careers. If opening 12,000 square feet of brand new exhibit space wasn't enough for you, we now have opened a newly renovated Hall of Discovery on the west side of the Science Center. This is 5,000 square feet of refurbished, new and improved exhibits. We raised the ceiling, we put in a new roof, new carpets, and you and your family will have a fantastic time exploring these favorites. The most exciting part of the Hall of Discovery will be a PNC-sponsored early childhood center. This thousand square feet of space will focus on a water table, we'll have an art mural wall in the back, we will have a photo station where children can go dress up as an astronaut, a doctor, a teacher, get their photos taken and they'll be able to leave the science center with that memory intact. It was very exciting working with the South Florida Science Center and Aquarium on their project that was just recently launched this winter. We extracted exhibits that were 10, 20, and 30 years old, and we put an environmental program together to actually extract as many usable parts, construction materials out of these old exhibits. So everything that you see there from the exhibits and the signage, we had a very green footprint that we we're trying to follow to keep sustainable here in West Palm Beach. You know, uh, within just a matter of uh, months, uh, certainly probably a year or so, uh, Florida will become the third largest state in the United States. To have a beautiful venue for kids coming down on vacations, uh, seasonal resident uh, grandchildren, and plus all the kids in the surrounding community who are permanent residents is just a, a tremendous asset for not only for the greater Palm Beach area, but for all South Florida. We can transform the power of science and the thinking about science. Again, we want our children to be lifelong learners in the field of exploring science. We have uh, managed to persuade two icons in the golf design industry who have never worked together before, the Nicholas family and the Fazio family, to actually work together to redesign our miniature golf course. We're calling it the conservation course. We would not be where we are today were it not for the generosity and the thoughtfulness of hundreds and hundreds of supporters of our museum. Some of them have given large amounts of money and we're certainly grateful to you. Some have given smaller amounts, but they've also given uh, of their energy and their ideas. Uh, we're also grateful to you as well. This museum is a testimony to community support at all levels and the fact that we can continue to do what we're doing into the future will depend on that support arising again and again and again and we're confident that it will. We are a high-touch community-based science center serving people time after time after time. We're a place where people come to do science and not to look at it. This area deserves a great science center and we are on the way to creating just that right here 
in Palm Beach County.